everyone, it's Nina aka Psycho Food. Today we're here at Eightfold Tea Shop and I'm here with my friend Arissa. Hello! <laughs> we're gonna try some of their drinks and so yeah! Yay. <laughs> Strawberry matcha, not strawberry and matcha. Yeah, <laughs> but I think most places they try to put like half of the fruit of one flavor and then mix it with the matcha just to combat it. Because I know a lot of people don't like matcha because it's really bitter. But yeah, then, it's bitter. But I do like matcha, and so here it looks like they should put like a cup of, of strawberry in it. Mm -hmm. So I guess that's what Arista was talking about, having it a little bit like less sweet and not overpowering. We're gonna try the deep matcha next. Let me mix it. <laughs> Arissa was mentioning this earlier because she said the deep matcha had um, matcha pudding matcha in it. Pudding. <laughs> and you said that's something that you don't usually see? Yeah, I don't usually see that, so that's why I really wanted to try it. Yes. I've seen like egg pudding, caramel pudding, taro pudding, but like matcha pudding is definitely new. Yeah. So I was really excited to try this. Yeah. Yeah, makes it well. <laughs> Whoa! This is like a sweeter matcha. A sweeter matcha? I think it might be the pudding. That's making it. Do you taste it? It's really jello y. Yeah. It's really good. What would you like rate this on like a matcha level? Like matcha being what? Really like, really like really matcha? Yeah, authentic. Um, let's see. Well, it's one of my goals to travel to Japan too to actually taste what their matcha tastes like because based on like what I've heard from people, their matcha is extremely bitter. <laughs> yeah. This one definitely, the reason why I didn't mix it up first is so that I could taste that bitterness and <laughs> definitely I tasted it. <laughs> and I, I could say that this is really matcha matcha and yeah. then the name for it, deep matcha, really matches the like the definition of this drink <laughs> so I really like it. Yeah, this one I feel like they put, they didn't put a lot of ice in it which is really good because then you can kind of, I kind of kicked the chin. <laughs> But you can kind of taste all like the matcha that they did put in it, and it's not watered down. We used to work at like a drink place, like, yeah, well how, how is that experience like for you? Prior to working at a boba shop, um, like my first boba experiences was at Quickly. My go-to from Quickly was taro slash wind boba, and like that's all I knew about boba before like, you know, I was able to venture out and go to other places. <laughs> it was like, whoa, this is totally different from like a terrorist slash with boba. So that's when I like started figuring out like there's so much more. Like there's actual teas. I never knew I was gonna work at a boba shop. <laughs> then one day like I needed work so I applied to Tenju and uh, the place is definitely different. We grew our teas from like tea leaves. Oh, and that's so nice. Yeah, yeah. There was like so much more option like besides like the basic options like milk tea, taro slush, honey tea slush, Thai tea. We also had a matcha drink there. That's when I realized like oh matcha is very delicate. Yeah. Because with the powder you have to use like a special um, whisk yeah. to make sure that like the drink no, 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 the powder and the drink like blends together. Like I spent a lot of time in that shop <laughs> working as a boba barista. Definitely opened my eye, made me love boba more. Um, I look for like actual tea-based drinks. Yeah. I fell in love with oolong, mm -hmm. like jazz, green tea, yeah. Ceylon. Like I actually pay attention to what kind of tea goes into the drink now. So I know that there's like there's like other food. Um, gurus who go to like Japan to try, actually try like their matcha. Like when people tell me like how bitter it is, like, I'm like, oh, what? <laughs> like what am I tasting now? Yeah, like, I'm like, I like sweet. <laughs> A tea that like I'm lo really looking forward to, to drink in Japan is called the hojicha tea. A hojicha is roasted green tea, and um, how I would describe it's like matcha but with like roastedness, like. The other experiences that I would want from Japan, I'm a huge anime fan, <laughs> so I really want to go to 
to those places. One Piece Park, the Naruto Park. Oh. Um, I think it's called um, Akihabara. There you go. <laughs> That's where all the otakus go and the leaves go. I was texting Arisa this like the last time because uh, like when I was younger, I kind of just like stayed at home by myself and just watched anime. And I didn't have like anyone to talk to. But then Arisa was like, oh, you know you have me now. Like, I can talk to you. So like, I think when I got into college, I like, started like watching a lot more anime because I felt like a little bit more comfortable <laughs> with yes. talking to Arisa. I've been cooking at the same time as I'm watching like, anime. But then it's hard to like read the subtitles and then like... Too. That's why we use our Japanese one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes. If you guys don't know, like Arisa and I met online first through like our class page for our college, and so uh, we both found out that we're both in Japanese 101 together, yeah. and so. Um, yeah, well, our friendship just started there. Yeah, and we have a lot of things in common. Like both Arisa and I are Filipino, and then like we're both short, and we're both born in like March. <laughs> we both love food. Oh yeah, we both love food. <laughs> she was like the first person like I hung out with from college, oh, and like yeah. we just ate the whole entire time. I know. Dude, and potato corner. That's what I like. We <laughs> are <I> go-to. <laughs> All right, thank you for watching everyone. Thank you, Arissa, for coming as well. And Arissa, do you have any like last words you want to say? Definitely thank you for inviting me. <laughs> this was a really nice experience. Yeah. Um, I would definitely try out Eightfold Tea Shop. Mm -hmm. um, they have very authentic and good matcha flavors. I'm about to order some more right now before we go. <laughs> yes. I can try some more at home with like the people I live with. Yeah. But thank you again, um, Eightfold Tea Shop, for inviting us. Make sure to follow them at Eightfold Tea on Instagram for some more jinx. Yay! Bye. No, yeah, I'm, and I'm still like re-watching a lot of animes now too. And I'm like, it's like reliving like everything. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm re-watching K-On right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I multitask sometimes because mm -hmm. I'm also re-watching Food Wars, the show who gets Oh my god, now. yeah. The third play, because um, for the fourth play just came out recently, and I want to make sure like I remember clearly what happened before going to the fourth season. I re-watched Meitsama as well. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> yeah. I, I read like both the manga, yeah, manga for that. I read the manga first and then watched the anime. I, don't remember, I can't remember if I watched the anime first or the manga. I'm usually one to like wait for all the, for the whole season to finish. I don't usually watch anime as it's like um, ongoing. Mm -hmm. Because I don't want to have to like wait. Like when I was watching Demon Slayer, I was like, why did I start like so early? Because oh, no. I actually thought I thought Demon Slayer had like a second season already. But then I <laughs> wait, over some wait, 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 wait. I got like Demon Slayer stickers, wow. and then all these like stickers from Demon Slayer. Wait, there's Sao too. Oh yeah, I know. So I knew I was gonna like meet Arisa here. <laughs> and then I was like, I should probably like bring this here. Cause I've been needing to like show this to you uh -huh. like, for a while. Wow. Yeah, yeah, you can pick a couple. You can pick a few. Yeah, if you guys haven't watched like Demon Slayer, you guys should. <laughs> but um, it's only turned into an anime. Yeah, yeah. <laughs>